Turkey has made new provocative statements, with Interior Minister Suleyman Soylu this time claiming that the natural gas deposits in the eastern Mediterranean belong to Turkey. The Turkish minister also spoke about the conversion of Hagia Sophia into a mosque and the opening of Varosha in Cyprus threatening Greece and Cyprus again with more aggressive actions. Because they said you cannot do it, we reopened the closed Varosha in Cyprus, with the will of our president, Suleyman Soylu said in a speech. Do you know what we did when we were busy with the pandemic? We turned the Hagia Sophia into a mosque, something they held over our heads for years like Damocles swords, threatening us with disturbing the peace and vowing not to let us convert it. I say this so that they understand and are ready for what we are gonna do," he added. Furthermore, speaking about the Eastern Mediterranean, he said, let the USA deal with us, as well as Europe. We took such a step without being afraid of anyone in the world. We have shown our strength and said if there is gas in the Eastern Mediterranean, then we are the owners. The statements of the Turkish Minister of Interior, of course, have nothing to do with reality and pose a threat to Greece and Cyprus, as the only way for Turkey to claim the whole eastern Mediterranean is to wage war against Greece and the Republic of Cyprus. Please like and subscribe to our channel Geopolitiki TV and help us grow faster on YouTube.